Well, boys and girls, it was a long day, and we are completely out of seed. Uh, we're going to have to get that fixed tomorrow. Tonight is sleepy time. Let's get to it. Alright, bud. See you later. All right, just got off the phone with Jake. So I had a contract for all of my seed and fertilizer already figured out last fall. So I had everything running last fall. The thing is, is for whatever reason, the co-op dropped the ball and I still don't have my seed and fertilizer. Problem is, is they are maxed out. They are super busy right now. So uh, I talked to Jake and uh, he said he will set everything aside for us. We just have to go pick it up ourselves. We don't get uh, customer uh, delivery. Yeah. Oh well. So I'm going to have to fire up the old Kenworth here. Listen to that thing purr. Oh man, we got a lot of stuff shoved into this little... Uh, shed here. I don't know. I'm hoping I can get by here. It's going to be awful tight. Oh, am I good over there? Alright. Just barely made it out of there. Alright, we got to head to town. I love driving this uh, T-800 with that C-15 in it. It just purrs. I especially love driving it, but I don't have a trailer back there. I don't know, it just seems like you got all the power to yourself. Really purrs down the road. Huh, even trailerless, this thing still rolls the coal. Uh, killing mosquitoes. Huh, pretty sure this stoplight is out. I've been sitting here forever. All right. Time for a quick cop scan. Oh, don't see anybody. Uh, here we go. Yeah. Yeah, there hasn't been anybody rolling through that whole intersection in the last five minutes I've been sitting there. All right. So I've got to get this floor jack here. So Jake set aside these seeds. These are all of our seeds that we need to fill up. He even marked them, if you can see. Stevio. Gonna get this uh, floor jack here. Gonna move it right over here. Pick up our first little uh, pallet of seed, hopefully. Lift that up. Move this over. Move this over so our forklift could easily pick it up. We might have to uh, end up just loading this. And I have an idea. I'm just going to load this up so I can move this to the front of the trailer. I'll show you. All right, getting a, another load of seed. Got to put it in to our little cupboard or uh, box trailer here. Go. Put it right in there. Oop, oop. Barely missed that though. Uh, there we go. Got one load of seed. Now I, I go in here and I get my little uh, cart here. Oh, oh, this thing is all touchy. There we go. Alright, that's good enough for government work. So now I just move this, and that way I can easily move these to the front of the trailer here. Alright, time for next pallet here.
Now we got this pallet. Just got to put this in the van. Raise her up. Sure would be nice if this, uh, if the co-op could do this for us, but, uh, I have to say, this is kind of fun doing this. You know, pallets isn't exactly always the funnest thing to do with uh, farming simulator physics. Alright, now that that pallet is there, now I just gotta get the floor jack and move it forward again. Alright, that is the last of our seed and fertilizer. Good thing, because we just have enough room just for this last pallet in our trailer. Fits just perfectly. There's a lot of weight in this trailer. Hopefully, anyways. Uh, well, will I fit this last pallet in the trailer? Alright, that's the last of it. We'll park uh, the co-op's little uh, forklift. We got a ton of seed. You could get, see all the way back there. We got seed pallets. We got fertilizer. We even got a few seed bags. Some little pioneers. But we're going with the seed containers this year. Shut these doors. There we go. Start this beast up. Start heading home. Hmm. Hopefully there's a uh, spot to turn around up here. Hmm, let's see how much we weigh. Oh, uh oh, we are almost overloaded. The seed is heavy. We're gonna fit in here. A tight fit. Hope. Oh, 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 that's close. That's really close to the unload auger. Oh, just barely fit. Finally, underweight. This, the police department will be proud of me for once. Look at all that pretty green right there. We're still looking for John Deere. Hmm. Oh, C-15 a purring. Down the road. This is going to be a hard turn. Really have to uh, take this nice and wide. Hmm. I haven't checked my mail today. Probably should here. Hmm. More bills. Big surprise there. All right. When I was running the trailer really felt like it wasn't running right and it was squeaking really bad so I think I'm gonna unhook it here I don't know if I need a grease that if I didn't put enough grease on that or hitch there or what the deal all right should have clearance I'm gonna try to get that uh unhook it try to see if we can grease that up little bit more. Don't want to drive it back like that. Yeah, we'll re-grease this uh, plate. Grease this. I don't... I'm hoping that it's just the plate and nothing else that is squeaking because that is one heck of a squeaking noise. Alright, so we did end up buying a Bobcat just like squads in 836 Turbo. Little Bobcat. Love this little thing. For whatever reason, Grant just didn't let us borrow it for good. I don't know why. 
I mean, what's wrong with just borrowing from a neighbor, you know? Borrow something, you just borrow it forever? No, I'm just joking. We want to be a good neighbor. Alright. Got this pallet. Gonna move this off the trailer here. Ooh, very carefully. This, uh, bobcat isn't exactly as easy as that, uh, forklift. Oh, I think that trailer is going down. Uh-oh. Uh oh oh man. Oh, I'm gonna try to get the bobcat over there to save it before it goes too far down. Gotta dr get this off of there. Get this offloaded as quickly as possible. Alright. Oh man, I don't know if this thing has enough lifting power. Oh man. The, uh, the trailer jacks basically just fell through. That, uh, our, uh, when we had our cave-in over here on the farm, that's really bothered it. Uh, come on. Pick her up. Pick her up. Uh, no. It ain't gonna do her. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, man. She even went, she's going farther down into the ground. It's like the ground is, uh, swallowing her up. Man, I did not think them seeds are that heavy. I guess we could start unloading the seeds pallets as quickly as possible. I really don't want to be in that trailer in case it tips sideways because it was going at an angle there for a second. Oh, man. Oh, let's get the truck out of the way here. Don't want this uh, poor girl getting uh, smashed. All right, move that out of the way. Oh man, I guess maybe I could try to get to the front of it. This loader has a little bit more lifting power. All right, try to not destroy the trailer that we just borrowed from the co-op. Try to get under it and have to definitely scoop down into the... Oh man, it just went down farther. Oh man, Gina, don't come over here. Hold a tractor. I just can't get that underneath there with that uh, AC unit on the top on the front of it. All right, gotta go find my forks for the tractor. Oh man, it's always this when everything is uh, in your way. Oh, okay, I need to get by this trailer right here. Man, I'm gonna have to go around the back side. Hitch that. Alright. Whew. Come on. Go find your forks here quickly. Go, 450. You got a trailer to save before the earth swallows it up. Alright, there's my forks. Alright, let's try to save this trailer. Whew. All right, try to very carefully not get this thing stabbed into the trailer. Oh, man. Come on, jab in there. Come on, you can do her. Pop in the wheelie. Uh, uh, oh, got a little bit. Oh, man. All right, let's see. Uh, uh. Doing a little uh, wheelie stands, the wrong type of wheelie stands. Just not enough junk in the trunk. At least this one uh, lifts up the loader for the rear end. Unlike uh, if you watch Millennial Farmer that recently did a situation, ran into a situation just like this. Most of the weight on these uh, tractors are the most lifting powers usually on the three-point hitch if we had uh, forklifts on the three-point hitch maybe we'll be able to uh, lift that old girl up Just dark this girl up all right now I got to unhitch that three-point off that tractor Put it on to here. And this would be 
our last saving grace to hopefully be able to uh, solve this issue ourselves. Gotta pick this up, put this over here, pin this up here. Oh man, this thing is heavier than what it looks like. All right, she is pinned up there. Gonna have to do a little bit of adjusting, it looks like, on my three point. All right, we are under it. Okay, now let's lift. But, uh, 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 oh, what? Man, I'm surprised we're not breaking off one of them forks. Oh. That thing is like the heaviest trailer ever. It is stuck down there real good. I don't know if I have any jacks around here I could use to lift it up. I guarantee one of the things, I wouldn't try it though. If we had a lift on the front of this uh, Lexion, that would probably get it lifted up because these Lex these harvesters have a ton of lifting power on the front end these heads are no joke heavy but uh, I wouldn't want to break an axle because that would be a serious expense all right we do not have a jack shoot 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 let's drag this thing over ah oh. oh, so heavy uh. all right drag it over there we go all right jump in this girl really not too uh, fond of uh, getting underneath there but I'm hoping if we dig right here get all this dirt around hopefully we can get that uh, dirt out. Probably needs to be reconditioned and packed anyways. Uh, let's start picking up all these rocks. Alright. Uh, just dump it right here. Uh, take another step. I think we almost had this dug down enough, hoping at least. All right, get this girl. Oh man, that's heavy. Heavy, 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 heavy. All right, dump this on our dirt pile here. Rock pile. Hate separating rocks from dirt. It's so annoying. All right. That's done. All right, let's fire this up now that we got it all greased up. Try to jam that thing underneath there. All right, here we go. Wish us luck. Oh, oh. All right, we got it jammed up underneath there. I was able to uh, jack up the jacks out from underneath the ground. Oh man, that thing, oh, we might have to give it a little a big, uh, a snug up front here to get her unstuck again after we move this uh, pallet that fell off the back over here. But uh, man, thank you all for watching this uh, disaster we have. Next time I think I'm just going to wait for Jake to uh, haul the seed to me. Definitely trust an expert and don't do it yourself if this proves anything. Thank you all for watching. Like, comment, and share and subscribe. See you next time. Alright, just about ready to give her a little love tap here. Ugh. Come on. Come on, you can do it. Oh man, is she stuck good.